So here's the welterweight champion, Leon Rocky Edwards. We are obviously excited to see how he handles this challenge here tonight, but how do you not harken back to the knockout against Kamal Usman? He's thrown that kick so many times in training and competition through it that night and changed his life forever. I mean, we have seen him do this time and time again. It's actually one of his better combinations. I want to see how quickly he tries to use that high kick now. I mean, this guy has a swagger about him. He has a confidence about him that allowed him to do what many thought was impossible. But tonight, Leon will have to rely on all of those things in order to keep his championship. But he will also need to use the wrestling. He will also need to use all of his striking in order to push back or defend from the challenge of this young woman competitor. Yeah, I mean, he seems motivated by the title win. If you look at his physique, I don't know if that's a six-pack, but Leon Edwards looks like he is in the best shape of his life coming in here tonight. A strong legacy. Few guys relish fight night as much as John Jones. You see him grinning ear to ear as soon as he hits the tunnel. We'll see how it goes in title defense number one. We send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the former UFC light heavyweight world champion, John Bones Jones! Herb Dean, our referee for this one. Ready. All right, so here we go with this highly anticipated stand-up only event. You gotta play by the rules here. The How's his opponent still stand? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Couple of chins here being tested early. Body shot. Big left hand lands upstairs. All right, first round is underway here. We say in mixed martial arts, it's one thing to have the reach advantage, it's another thing to use it. We'll see if he can get that jab going to He has got to fight tall. He's got to stay tall. <laughs> Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Missed on the right hand. Counters now with the leg kick, nicely done by Jones. Right back on those leg kicks. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You gotta go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and take your time. 
He's right for the picket. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> Edwards is dwelling now around the jaw area, so we'll keep an eye on that as this fight continues. to go. Well, you gotta think he might be trying to set up that overhand again. He's found a home for it all night long. Let's see if that holds true. Oh. Strong outside leg kick. Oh! With authority, the body. Oh, beautiful combination. that beautiful chat. All right, so John Jones having his way with an opponent as we have come to expect in the octagon. He's got the long-range weapon we're going to. I mean, it's the striking of Jones, his ability to set traps, his ability to make you fight his fight at his range. When you can't close the distance on Jones, you will have problems. That's exactly what's happening with his opponent tonight. He has not been able to get close enough to find success. Second round, straight ahead. So there is the horn standing ovation from this capacity. Let's just go 10 minutes straight. Pride rules. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Ready, Ready. All right, second round underway. Rips the body there. Oh, and he lands again. Oh, nice low kick. Leg kick checked by Edwards. I give one, I take one. You give one, you take one. That's how this fight is being played out. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Fighter lands a kick to the leg now, and a pretty good one at that. Oh, nice combination there. He is just killing him with volume time. Jab. Right hand, body shot, I mean kicks. What a masterful show of different techniques and ability to throw a combination. 50 total strikes have landed for Leon Edwards. And the connection rate, pretty good. 55% to this point in the fight against John Jones. Under three minutes here to go in the round. Well, the calf kicks all the rage, but he's not discriminating, attacking the thigh pretty effectively. Yeah, we have seen that time and time again. Start a mixed martial arts, people throw leg kicks. Right now, you can see him digging his shin into this guy's thigh. Left punch on target tonight. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Oh, that right thigh starting to weld. Some serious bruising going on here. Big shot to the head. Oh, how about the accuracy to land right there? His opponent's wobble champ. He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. And right hand. Ooh. Nice leg kick. All right, so he lands again, just like we saw in the last round, realizing a lot of success with his Muay Thai game. You know, why change it? It's working, and it's working from the very start of the fight. The moment this fight started, you saw the advantage that we predicted was there. He started to take advantage of it early, and now he's continuing to build on that. This kickboxer looks amazing tonight. Edwards' nose is bleeding now. Looks to be cut, perhaps, there on the bridge. He's hurting bad here. We got 
the turtle in that kick. Final seconds here. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, so there's the end of the round. You see the blood trickling down as he makes his way back to the stool. Cut on the bridge of the nose, or so it appears from the strike in that round. Cut man getting right to work. All right, as they attend to the damaged fighter, we will re-rack some replays for you. A lot of damaging strikes landed by the opposition in that previous round. Well, him just not really paying attention on the defensive side has made his opponent look like an absolute world beater. He's a good fighter, but he has never looked this good. And that is, that is partly because his opponent is not defending. You ready to fight? You ready? The third yeah. round underway. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. All right, mixing up the leg kicks nicely, and that thigh starting to show some visible signs of bruising. Him. You know, you can't even worry about what that high. Somehow, his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Oh, huge left. That one is going to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Back to the leg kick now, that one's no good. Edwards gets tattooed by that straight punch. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Left hook to the head. Oh, he has landed a high volume of strikes in this round and really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Lead hook is good by Edwards. Fighting from your range is so important. Beautiful punch lands again. Lands a nice leg kick. Big head kick. So 101 total strikes have now landed for Leon Rocky Edwards. We're on a pretty good connection rate thus far, hitting on one out of every two. The accuracy rate is 50% against John Jones. Edwards is blocking well now. Made the adjustment, protecting what is an already damaged nose. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was gonna invest in the body and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. to the championship rounds. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned. A huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Patented front kick there by Jones. 
straight punch lands. Well, this is absolutely the hurt business. It's hard to see which party is more injured, but I think both fighters have been really affected with their strikes in this one. Yeah, both guys have been affected. Both guys have been beat up. It's a very competitive fight. Let's see who has the heart to carry them through these very tough moments. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Edwards. Well, at times he's tried to check kicks, but he has not been effective in doing so. And now he's starting to limp a little bit. He's starting to limp from those leg kicks. He's showing that it's hurting. That's a, that's a big sign when you watch a fighter, because a fighter never really wants to give you anything, but he can't help himself. Beautiful strike there as he continues to attack that cut. Cut man's gonna have some work to do if we get to the stool between rounds. But that's why we got the best in the business. We got the best cut men in the business, and they are going to need him right now because this cut is getting worse, and it's only gonna continue to get worse because he has got a killer in front of him. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Man, has his chin been tested early. Oh, that's big. That was a good Nice strike. Jones, his nose is bleeding now. So we'll see how he handles that adversity. But nothing ideal about it here in the middle of this fight. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, he landed a beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach, and Sully is making it count in this one. Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. Edwards' is cut on his nose is just pouring blood at this point. Time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, he got him hurt oh, bad here. What a fight so far. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and he heads back to the stool, and hopefully he can stay in this fight because that is a severe cut that he's dealing with right now. All right, well, defense wins championships, and perhaps he can shore some things up there. Here are some replays from the damaging previous round. Well, he's got to. He's got to change some things if he doesn't want this cut to get worse. But hats off to his opponent. His opponent found the target. His opponent knew exactly what he wanted to accomplish, and he got it done. He's got to continue on the path in order to make the cut worse. Ready to fight. Ready. Go. It is the fifth and final round. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. All right, well, that blow is bossing from that cut with each strike landed, and he continues to effectively target that area. You know, we are talking about a guy with a super high fight IQ. So when you give him that blood, that crimson red is nothing more than something that inspires oh, Thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent up a little bit, trying to stay upright. But man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Oh, outstanding placement as he lands the knee of the body. Again, the taller fighter making noise with a knee strike there. So I'm gonna hit you and then you hit me. Back and forth we go. This is one of the best fights I've called all year. Yeah, one of the best fights. And it, it the, the blood, the injuries only add to the entry. It only adds to who's gonna continue down the path and get the hand raised. Both of these guys are so tough, they really have laid it on the line. Nice spinning attack to the body lands for him. If you're gonna go out, go out on your shield. If you're going out, go out on your shield. Don't just walk backwards. Go forward. Make him fight you. Now his opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on Beat Street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's going to do to stay in this fight. Oh, oh, both land.
aggressive and more loose with his strikes. He's landing. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Oh, absolutely getting after it. Huge shots landing on both sides. Edwards is really bleeding heavily now. That cut is only getting worse by the minute. Nice crack there. Oh, and he lands another shot. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. An elbow! Jones's kick attempt, that one was blocked. Just out of range with the straight left hand. Oh, is that a big move? The body will see if he can follow up. What a fight! 25 minutes turned in! A lot to like over the distance of that fight tonight. Clearly, we think we saw one guy win the fight and largely got it done with the striking. Yeah, he got it done with the striking. And that's exactly what he's known for. He's known as a guy that's so comfortable whenever he's in the stand-up. And that showed tonight as he truly outworked his opponent. The official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest. 48-47, 49-47, and 48-47. For the winner, by unanimous decision, John Bones All right, so you heard it there from Bruce Buffer. John Jones, your winner tonight by decision, and this sets him up for a massive opportunity here moving forward at heavyweight. It's always opportunities for Jones. Because of the work that he has put on paper in the past, you always view him as a title contender. Tonight, this type of decision win ensures that he will be on the shortest of guys looking to take on the champion.